fellas beyond nervous this morning. The playoff semi-final at home to West Bromwich Albion. I'm just so nervous. Um, yesterday we went to the Football Blogging Awards. Um, if you haven't already watched that video, we did a sort of roundup video of it, uh, just a vlog of the day. If you haven't already watched that, please do. We did a preview to this game as well, but it's probably out of date by the time you're watching this, so you can watch it if you want. But anyway, today, Oh, Villa Park is going to be a sight to behold today. It's sold out. There was people begging for tickets all over the place. Like we could, we could easily have sold like a 50, 60,000 seat stadium today. But Villa Park is going to be absolutely rocking. West Brom are bringing their 2,000 fans, and it's such a massive game. And it's such a hard one to call. Obviously, we got the return leg on Tuesday, but this is the one we got to focus on at the moment. We got to get an advantage in the home leg and then go there and do whatever we have to do. But I'm so nervous. We're all going down. It's, it's going to be such a fantastic day if we win. Um, but obviously it's just going to be half time in the two legs. So if we do win, we can't get too high. If we don't win, we can't get too low. We just got to get our heads and just go again in the second leg uh, on Tuesday. But as I said, I'm nervous. We just got to do it. Got to sing, got to be proud of the villa. Let's do it. Come on. Morning. It's, today's the day. It's the big one. <gasps> you, you excited? Um, yeah, I think it'll be quite a good day. A little bit nervous, but not the fact that we won't win. It's more the case, will we actually get the job done? Will we do enough to take it back to their place and look after ourselves? Yeah, Have Luke. Day. Right. All right. <laughs> Boys, big one. Tom, let's go first. Thinking, what are we thinking today? 3 0 Villa. Oh my god. We're going to win the playoffs. 3 0 Villa. Ollie, what are we thinking? 3 1. Wow. Nice one, mate. Carlo, what are we thinking? 2 0. 2 0. We all confident then? Yeah. Nice one, boys. We're here. I'll be at home. Thoughts? Thoughts? I don't know. How many feels we're going to beat them, aren't we? Oh. Confidence. Yeah. Give us a score. Give us a score. 2-0. 2-1. 2-0. Absolutely. Oh my god, what's going on here? Anyway, thoughts. <laughs> score predictions, what are we thinking? Um I was I'm optimistic. I think we can do it. 2-1. If I wanna be really optimistic, yeah. 3-0. Oh <laughs> Martin, thoughts. It's gonna be a difficult game today, but I think I think 2-1 at Villa Park tonight. Yeah. And 1-1 one, one at the Hawthorns. I'll take that. And uh, Wembley, here we come. We're going to Wembley. Yeah, I'll Love it. Sure. Score predictions, boys, what are we think here? Um, uh, uh, 2-1 Villa. 2-1. 3-0 Villa. 3-0. Nice one. Jamie, it's cold, it's wet, it's Albion at home. Thoughts? Right, fresh off the FBAs, we won, as everyone knows. I'm going to say 2-1 Villa. But I'll probably change it if we say 2-1. But come on the Villa. Let's Woo! Go. Tottenham Nicole. Get on me! <laughs> come on, you Spurs. <laughs> yes, yes, prediction. Thoughts? 3-1. Um, Second leg. Are we going to make it to Wembley? Most definitely. <laughs> we going up? Not a chance that we're not. Up the Villa! Ben, thoughts, predictions, what are we thinking? 3-0. Uh, 3-0, we're we going to Wembley. Yeah. Oh, I love that sun. Dan Bosnich. Dan, look at this day. Right, give us the score prediction. Go 2-1. 2-1, 2 I'm not going to come out here and be like, yeah, definitely, definitely. Nice one. I just want to say well done on your award, Max. Really, really good. Nice one, mate. Score predictions, Bob, what are we thinking? 3-0, Villa. 3-0. Big shout out to the Blockers lawyers, yeah? Look, Max, say Blockers lawyers. Blockers lawyers, yeah! Yeah! Score prediction! 1-0 Villa! 1-0! Are we going to Wembley? Yes! Yes, come on! Oh, yes, boy! Come on, Score prediction! 2-0! Come on, Baby Davis! 2-1 the Villa! Come on! McGinn and Abraham! Come on! Come on, David!
side, they did a bar, it was offside, Jeff Sears made an unbelievable save. Them not thought it was him. Like five at the back, and they've nicked the goal. Yeah. That's what they've done. Yeah, yeah. And then they're going to sit on it now, mate. They're going to sit on it, take back the old and try and do us. We've been poor. We have, we, yeah, have been yeah. poor. we have been poor. But second half, the Villa always right well. Attacking the old. Yeah, attacking the old. We've got, to, we've got to stay positive, we've got to stay positive. Listen, Blockage Lions. 1-0 down. Oh, this is not ideal. Trevet, they've come here and they've executed their game plan. They've nicked a goal, Glen Wheeler mistake. They've been, they've been okay, they've got five at the back, but we haven't created anything clear cut. Um, they've nicked a goal, Wheeling is Wheeling's fault. But apart from that, they haven't had too much, we haven't had too much. I just know we've been too poor, Grealish is straight too deep. Wheeling hasn't been amazing. Down the wings, the quality's not been there. I want to see Andre Green second half, but it's been poor, it's been poor.
Aston Villa is back in the team. The goal machine number 18, Tony Everton! Come on! Aston Villa have won the league in the Premier Yes! Time waste now! I dare you to time waste now! Dwight Gale, mate, is the biggest I dare you to time waste! <laughs> <Where's the background? laughs> Easy. Oh, well, uh, that, that was eventful. Um, what a day. I mean, it's only half time. Do not get ahead of ourselves, but that was amazing. I think we scored in the 75th minute or something like that. And before that, we were awful. Even West Brom weren't fantastic. They, get, they got a goal, and that goal shocked them. Like, Gail wasn't expecting that. It was, it was a mistake from Whelan. We all know it. An, an un uncharacteristic mistake because he's been very good recently. And I do feel sorry for him. There was a debate before the game. Whelan, Horahan, who should start? I think we all know who's going to start on Tuesday. Horahan, what a finish that was. When he scored, I flew forward about five rows. You've probably seen it on the video. Like, I've... I've took out about eight people. I'm sorry about that. Anyway, what a day. Um, the Grealish penalty, I haven't seen it yet. There's obviously Baggy fans saying, oh, he dived, but I haven't seen it yet. Gale was a walking red card all game. I think the first one was for time-wasting because uh, he did that a lot with throw-ins. Um, well, that went well. Uh, and he got sent off, so that's good. I mean, they've only got Jay Rodriguez for Tuesday. I'm not sure who's going to come in for him, uh, for Gale, but... We'll see. Tuesday, if we draw, we're going to Wembley. It's simple as that. But I think we won't go for the draw. We'll go there, go for the early goal. And we've just got to go for it because Tuesday, there's going to be 2,000 Villa there. The atmosphere at the Hawthorns isn't going to be as good as it was at the uh, Villa Park today. It was amazing today. The big flag before the game, that was class. And it was really, really good. I think it was a bit, a bit, a bit dodgy in the middle of the game. But my God, when Horahan popped that in, fantastic stuff. Um, but yeah, we weren't fantastic today. Mings didn't have his best game. Grealish and McGinn were out the game, but which is weird because we still won. But yeah, we've got to go to the Hawthorns on Tuesday. It's going to be massive. I'll be there. There'll be a video. Please do subscribe if you haven't already. Already. Um, yeah, and up the villa. <sighs> Can we do it? Come on. <laughs> <laughs>